Welcome back to our channel, Dear Voyagers. In today's video, let's look at a story of a space dog who sacrificed herself for humanity. Space is a harsh environment with no air to breathe, extreme temperatures, and high levels of radiation. Astronauts need specialized gear like spacesuits and spacecraft to protect them. However, with the right technology and precautions, humans have successfully lived and worked in space for months at a time. But this is possible due to some of the experiments in the past. Scientists needed to understand the effects of space travel on living organisms before sending humans into space. They turned to animals as test subjects, as they share many biological similarities with humans. One of the first animals chosen for space experiments was the fruit fly, due to its short lifespan and quick reproductive cycle. These experiments provided valuable insights into the impact of space travel on biological processes. Other animals, such as mice, monkeys, and dogs, were also used in space experiments to study the effects of microgravity and space radiation. These experiments paved the way for human space exploration and helped ensure the safety and well-being of astronauts. Laika was a stray dog from the streets of Moscow, chosen by Soviet scientists for a groundbreaking space mission in 1957. Her mission was to test the effects of space travel on a living organism, providing crucial data for future human space exploration. Laika was trained rigorously for her space journey, undergoing simulations to prepare her for the challenging conditions of spaceflight. On November 3, 1957, Laika was launched into space aboard the Sputnik 2 spacecraft, becoming an icon of space exploration. During her mission, Laika's vital signs were monitored to study her physiological responses to the stresses of space travel. Her heartbeat rocketed to triple the normal rate, and her breath rate quadrupled. At the peak of acceleration, her heart rate was 240 beats per minute. Thermal control system did not function properly, hence raising the cabin temperature to 40 degrees Celsius. Sputnik 2 was not designed retrievable, so it was accepted that Laika would die. We're glad that we are way past using animals for testing. Laika will always be remembered in our hearts. Tragically, Laika did not survive the mission, but her sacrifice paved the way for advancements in space technology and understanding the impact of space travel on living organisms. Her legacy lives on as a symbol of courage and exploration, inspiring future generations to push the boundaries of scientific discovery. The humane use of animal testing spaceflight was essential to preparation for manned spaceflight. In 2015, Russia unveiled a new memorial statue of Laika atop a rocket at a Moscow military research facility. And when the nation honored fallen cosmonauts in 1997 with a statue at the Institute of Biomedical Problems in Star City, Moscow, Laika's image could be seen in one corner. During the Mars Exploration Rover Opportunity Mission in March 2005, NASA unofficially named a spot within a Martian crater, Laika. This shows the respect towards this animal for pushing humanity to their furthest limits.